A federal high court in Abio Kutaogun State has adjourned a case seeking to void the nomination of Olushola Akimbode as the All Progressives Congress APC candidate for the November 16 local government election in the state. The plaintiff, Benga Akimwande, had challenged the APC primaries that led to Akimbode's selection and nomination as the APC's Yewa North Council chairmanship candidate. Akimwande named the APC and Ogun State Independent Electoral Commission, OGCEC, as defendants in the case. Akimwande urged, or argued rather, that Akimbode did not participate in the party's candidate screening process on November 2nd and that his emergence as the APC's candidate did not follow due process, party guidelines, or electoral laws. At Tuesday's hearing, the APC and Akimbode's lawyer, Edward Ayo or Dubesson, told the court that they had filed a preliminary objection arguing the plaintiff lacked standing to bring the case. The plaintiff's lawyer, John Apinishele, disagreed with the objection. Justice Jordan Ademi heard the case. Uh, usually when cases are filed in courts, uh, the progress of such cases are guided by existing rules of practice and procedure. Uh, the court at the last adjourned date ordered a proper uh, proof of service on all the defendants in the case, which are all progressive Congress, the Ogun State Independent Electoral Commission. Thankfully, they have all been properly served. And so today, they all have legal counsel appearing for them in court, while the third defendant personally attended court himself. This morning, per force of, uh, like I told you earlier, the procedure of guiding such action as this one, they are entitled in law to about 30 days to respond, which uh, is running from the date we filed the action. Um, from reckoning, they are still having some time within which they can respond. They asked for this time to be utilized, and the court According to the law, they grant them that though we would have wished that the, ma the matter could be fixed for a shorter time, but then that is the law. The matter was filed on the 16th, and we have 30 days to respond, to file our processes. We are still within time to file our processes, and I'm sure if you are in court, you will note that we mentioned that to the court. Um, but yesterday we filed our process, we filed a preliminary objection, which says to the effect that um, the, uh, the, 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 the claimant has no locus to bring the application. And also we says that, um, well, there are many grounds, I, we are not in court, I don't have to, but we filed our preliminary objection, we filed our appearance, and the second defendant has also filed, that's Oxek, filed the counter affidavit. So we are good to go. But for the fact that the plaintiff counsel has to respond to those processes before the matter can be heard, that was. And then, of course, the uh, bailiff section has not served all our processes on the plaintiff counsel, and that was why the court adjourned the matter. You know, so that all the parties can file their process, respond to the processes. And then we will come by the grace of God on the 13th to hear the case. Justice Adeyemi, however, adjourned the matter till November 13 for hearing. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.